Hi, I'm Tommy from Buy2ARadios.com. In this tutorial, we'll be going over how to set up your Ocean programming cable on Windows 11. These instructions will work for most Ocean programming cables, including the PCO001, 003, and 009. The question we need to ask, is the driver needed? So first, we should check to see if we already have the necessary driver installed and working on the PC. To find this out, we must plug the cable into a USB port on our PC and open the Windows Device Manager. In the Device Manager, click on the arrow next to Ports, COM, and LPT to list the available ports. From there, look for an item named Silicon Lab CP210X. This is the cable's driver. If you see this, then your cable should already be working and installing the driver should not be required at all. To use this cable, note the COM port number shown to the right and select this port number in the radio's programming software. However, if you do not see Silicon Lab CP210X in the list, or if you see an unknown device, then you do not have the driver and it will need to be installed. Installing the driver. Unplug the cable from your PC and make sure that the device disappears from the device manager. Then make your way to buy2aradios.com to download the driver software. You can use this URL to find our most popular downloads. Once you have finished downloading, extract the files and run the installer. This is what it's called, and Windows should verify that it is indeed the installer, and the installer should walk you through the process. Now that the driver is installed, we can plug the cable back into the computer. Open up the device manager once again and repeat step one. Now we should see Silicon Lab CP210X listed in the ports COM and LPT section. And from here on out, you should only need to select the displayed COM port in the programming software to program your specific radio. To order an Ocean programming cable, click the link in the description below. I'm Tommy from Buy2ARadios.com. Thanks for watching.